Well, Douse, the final whistle's just gone here at Gander Green Lane. Yeah. I'm sure you're very pleased with the performance to get a nil-nil draw against a strong Sutton. But before we come to that, perhaps you'd like to tell us a little bit more about the 50-lap challenge on Wednesday. Yeah, I just hope people in back it. It's not trying to take over the commercial um, department. It's not trying to take over what, how much we direct us. It's just a little thing we'll try to help, and that's all it is, trying to help. If anybody can sponsor in any way, to try to help. Five are here, ten are there. It'll be fantastic. We're going to start about three o'clock and see how we get on and um, but I would love the people to help out because um, we believe it will help the club we believe it will um, it'll help out on the budget as well um, so if anybody can help out I really appreciate it but we'll start about 3 o'clock on um, on um, obviously Wednesday, Wednesday before the Chelsea game so if anybody can come down and watch come down and have a laugh and me, Martin and Ian and um, um, Martin's going to start at 1 o'clock because <coughs> uh, he's going to walk and all that you know but me and Ian we we'll have to run, which I've done 25 laps. You have idea, I nearly keel over. But um, it was after the England game and over, I had a few pains, so I thought I might struggle. <laughs> How are you going to organise it? Are you going to just do a relay and one person does one no, lap? No, we'll just do 50 together, and I think a couple of people from the club will mark them off. But oh, if okay. anybody wants to come down and join in and help and mark a few things off or drinks breaks, we might need a couple, to be honest. So, um, I, know, so I'm del- you know, I want to do it for the club. I like doing fundraisers and helping out. And like I say, it's nothing... I know what your budget is and I'm pleased and I, I know the commercial girls do fantastic jobs to do and um, all it is I just want to try to just keep on doing things for the community really and this will go towards you know getting a player like what Greg Lewis just agreed to sign there so little things like that we can top things up you know Great OK well we'll look forward to that I'll be there get some photos record the event <laughs> and uh, hope to get some nice facials during, <laughs> during that run. You'll certainly get that after the first couple of laps. <laughs> is, is Martin going to be jet-lagged, or is he going to be all right? He'll make some excuse, he will. That's what he will. But he's got to get round, which he'd done before. He'd done a while ago. Um, and we'd, we'd done a similar thing at Hampton to raise money for the academy. And Martin done 50 laps, but he's walking, which you know he should do. Me and Ian have promised to run. And we won't stop, but um, Craig, I just hope I finish it before the kick-off, you know? Right. OK, well, that, that should be fun. Right. Uh, so, turning to today's two games, let's start at Spellthorn, yep. uh, which I didn't see any of, so yeah. tell us about that. I don't know, I don't know it was a, obviously, it missed some maths to say, but the, the pluses was Reggie Dun- Young done very well again. Did you? Sam kept a clean sheet, um, which was good. We played the last 35 minutes with 10 men. Was I got his 45 minutes in, but looks as though he needs a few more 45s, to be honest. Christian Jolly got his fitness quicker, you know, you know. So uh, Declan scored a free kick and Kofi scored. So, it's, sort of, it's been a good day for the club, really. A um, lot more positive and good in the right direction, I believe. Um, and I was delighted with that, to be honest. And especially Reggie's performance this morning. Big Dwayne done okay as well. And um, he said, was I need some games. Today, I thought we were excellent. I thought defensively, we, uh, we should have won it at the end, obviously, with a chance from yeah. the trailers kid. But um, he's a young kid from Watford. He's just come for a trail. And, and um, I thought we were defensively excellent today. Because I knew about they got a bit of sticky of night against the unbelievable women side. But these are a great conference premier side. We'll be up there again this year. And obviously, um, I thought defensively we were fantastic. And when we do get past off, really, we had the best chances, I believe, really. It took them 84 minutes to hit a post. But listen, Doswell's got a good side. You know, with Betty there, they'll all be well organised. And I thought our lads dug in. Unbelievable. I really did. Especially with all the subs we had, and we've only had four. We had to keep our lads on. and you know, I give a few, but I was really pleased the day. I, you know, I'm not going to get carried away, just like I didn't get too down about the working game. I, I was delighted about the day, to be honest. Yeah, I couldn't agree more. I think um, that that was a very, very strong Sutton squad. Yeah. I won't say squad because uh, some people came on in the second half that are fairly regular first team players, um, and, and we, we reasonably held them. It, it wasn't a very one sided nil nil draw. Yeah. Uh, they probably had more possession and, and more territory, but. Come out with credit. Come out with credit. I just had the word Greg Lure, who wants to join me, which I'm pleased about that. So he'll sign on Wednesday. We believe we've got a centre forward coming in on Wednesday as well. Maybe at, um, yeah, for Wednesday as well. But Nick's done all right up there as well. And obviously, Kian Fernand, who obviously very keen on. So this is bit by bit and shape the team up. And we're three weeks away, but we'll, we'll need these three weeks to sort of nail in. And every week's got to be a, a little improvement. And um, obviously, Chelsea will be very good, I imagine, technically. <coughs> Then we've got Salford, who are, I think, the promotion favourites and all that, you know. But um, I was a bit, like, after we went out working, I was a bit like, 
you know, because it was a testimonial, it's not my sort of games. Uh, um, so the bottom line is today was a proper game against a proper side in two good tests, and I think we've come through very well. So I feel as well as positives, to be honest, today. Absolutely. OK, that's splendid. Thanks very much for yeah, your time. Exactly. All the very best on Wednesday, and thanks we'll see much. you there. OK, thanks very much, then.